With the impeachment trial over, Senator Chuck Schumer is making the rounds across New York State, including in Syracuse today. The Senate Minority Leader is calling on the federal government to help get what are called ghost guns off our streets. Ghost guns are basically do-it-yourself firearms that have no serial numbers to trace, where the gun was bought and other crimes it may have been used in. Before 2018, only one of these ghost guns was found here in Onondaga County, but in 2018, a jump to eight being confiscated. Then an even bigger number last year. 23 were used in crimes in Syracuse. News Channel Line's Andrew Donovan explains how the senator plans to fix this problem. Can I pick one up? Senator Chuck Schumer frequently uses props to make his point. On this table, he has many to choose from. It looks like a normal gun. Senator Schumer invited by the Onondaga County District Attorney, who's alarmed by the 23 ghost guns his office seized as evidence from different shootings in 2018. Look at the uh, firepower in front of you and the evil that this has caused just in Onondaga County. Six-year-old male shot in the back. That includes the gun Miguel Russo used to shoot his six-year-old nephew on Fenton Street in December, which he then turned toward police officers who had to act first. Drop that gun. August 5th, nine shots fired Fitch Street. August 22nd, 11 shots fired Sabine Street. August 24th, 12 shots fired Merriman Ave. Uh, September 9th, 14 shots fired 200 Putnam Street. September the 15th, 17 shots fired Merriman Ave. That's one gun. At a quick glance, this gun looks like a rifle any legal gun owner could buy in the state of New York. The only difference with this one, it was ordered online, shipped in pieces with no serial numbers, and then put together at someone's home. So, you know, you get online, you send in a certain amount of money, and you get 80% of a gun. And in some cases, all you have to do is drill a couple of holes, and you've now you've got an automatic operable weapon. Because each piece doesn't have a serial number, the gun isn't traceable and gives felons access to weapons they can't get legally. Senator Schumer is pushing the Justice Department to change the 1968 definition of a firearm to include the individual pieces, which would make selling them harder. It can just happen with the stroke of a pen. You don't need legislation. They can just change the definition. The law allows them to do that. Another chance for Republicans and Democrats to work together. In Syracuse, Andrew Donovan, News Channel 9. And the district attorney tells Andrew that he suspects Onondaga County has seen so many ghost guns because local officers are doing such an effective job getting illegal guns off the street that criminals are resorting to other sources for their weapons.